Now let us move on to the third question. Multiply and reduce to the lowest form. So let us first consider the first bit. So we need to multiply 7 and 3 by 5. So 7 times 3 by 5 is equal to. So to multiply 7 and 3 by 5 we need to multiply the numerators and also we need to multiply the denominators respectively. Therefore 7 times 3 divided by 1 times 5 this gives 21 divided by 5 since 21 and 5 do not have a common factor the lowest form is 21 divided by 5 now let us move on to the second bit 4 times 1 by 3 so we multiply the corresponding numerators and denominators so 4 times 1 divided by 1 times 3 this gives 4 by 3 since 4 and 3 that is the numerator and denominator do not have a factor in common therefore the lowest form of the fraction is 4 by 3 now let us consider the third bit 2 times 6 by 7 so we multiply the corresponding numerators and denominators 2 times 6 divided by 1 times 7 this gives 12 by 7 since 12 and 7 do not have a fa factor in common the lowest form is 12 by 7 so now let us take the fourth bit 5 times 2 by 9 so we shall multiply the corresponding numerator and denominator therefore 5 times 2 divided by 1 times 9 this gives 10 by 9 since 10 and 9 do not have a common factor the lowest form of the fraction is 10 by 9 itself now let us move on to the fifth bit 5 by 2 divided by 5 by 2 multiplied by 6 so let us multiply the numerators and denominators respectively so 5 times 6 divided by 2 this gives 30 divided by 2 but 2 goes in 30 15 times so 2 times 15 gives 30 therefore the product of 5 by 2 times 6 is 15 now let us move on to the fifth bit 2 by 3 multiplied by 4 so let us multiply the numerators and the denominators respectively so we have 2 times 4 divided by 3 which is equal to 8 by 3 since 8 and 3 do not have a common factor the lowest form of the fraction is 8 by 3 itself so now let us move on to the seventh bit 11 times 4 by 7 so we shall multiply their numerators and denominators respectively so we have 11 times 4 divided by 7 which is equal to 44 by 7 since 44 and 7 do not have a common factor the lowest form of the fraction is 44 by 7 itself now let us move on to the 8th bit 20 times 4 by 5 so let us multiply the numerators and denominators respectively 20 times 4 divided by 5 gives 80 by 5 since 5 goes in 86 times 16 times so the product of 20 times 4 by 5 is 16 let us move on to the ninth bit we have 13 times 1 by 3 so we shall multiply the numerators and denominators respectively so 13 times 1 divided by 3 gives 13 by 3 since 13 and 3 do not have a factor in common the lowest form of the fraction is 13 by 3 itself now let us move on to the tenth bit 15 times 3 by 5 so let us multiply the numerators and denominators respectively 15 times 3 divided by 5 we have 45 by 5 so 45 and 5 have a common factor 5 so 5 goes in 45 9 times therefore the product of 15 times 3 by 5 is 9